Well, one thing too is like, I want to ask, I know you probably answered this question already. How important is the diversity to this, to the, all of us uh, research program, and especially even for medical research? Yeah, so I, I can tell you that, um, especially with health disparities, like with the improvement technology and how we identify new treatment, new prevention modalities, and now especially with personalized and precision medicine, uh, we really need to look at every individual as the individual. Mm -hmm. So imagine that if we have a whole group of people that they don't wanna participate and they have doubts about uh, medical research, then you know, like they're gonna be left out when mm -hmm. we know that we when we get the discovery, you know, like how then if mm -hmm. if if you or me and we don't want to be part of this, don't wanna participate, then when we when we go for treatment or we need to be prevention, we're not included. Um, like I had one of my uh, team member from the community that used to work with me long time ago and help with the message that we all have to participate on those new discoveries. She says, because when they write the medical books, we have to be in it. Yes. But if you're not in it, you're not in it, you know? So, yeah. so everybody has to be included. And also if we're not, this is gonna increase the gap of health disparities because then the ones that they always be part of research are always we know about, the ones that they're not, we'll never know about. So health disparity is gonna widen and we can't have health equity. So we wanna take part, you know, we want everybody to take part. Everybody that's live in rural communities, live in low income neighborhoods, coming from different ethnic background, coming from different race, is it old, is it young, is a woman, is a man? You know, we this this really initiative, and that's why we call it all of us. Mm -hmm. It needs everybody, it's all of us to be part of the study. So now that we're five years into the program, where do you see the next five years with this with this program? So Go we're on. hoping that the next five years we're gonna continue to reach our goals for the um for the million, for sure, that is gonna be very important for us. Um, mm -hmm. We're hoping that the data that we, and the information that we're collecting will speed up our medical research. More people are gonna look at this data and find uh, more information and um, will drive really the medical research to be, um, to, be, um, to, be, to get people to be more healthier. So um, so we are hoping that the next five years, people are gonna start to, to use the data that we are now collecting to really find more findings and speed up uh, the discovery. Okay, and before I end. Do you know what's happening in Birmingham? Download the What's Happening Birmingham app today on Android, iPhone, and iPad for free. Get info on everything you need to know about local news, events, businesses, restaurants, and more. Visit our website, whatshappeningbham.com, or follow us on social media at Happening Beham for more information. Download the What's Happening Birmingham app today, your source for everything Birmingham.